click the bell icon to get latest videos from ekida hello friends in this topic we'll understand the channel assignment strategies how the channels are divided to multiple users the entire available spectrum is divided into two types of channels that is voice channel and control channels as we all know control channels are only used for setup purposes called initiation called request and so on and hence very less number of control channels are required ideally only one control channel pair is required for one cell hence the entire spectrum is divided in such a way that we have few control channels and maximum voice channels 5% of the allotted spectrum is divided as control channel and the remaining 95% of the spectrum is given as voice channels there are two types of channel assignment strategies the first strategy is fixed channel assignment here the users are provided with fixed channels for transmission and reception in fixed channel assignment strategy every cell is given a fixed set of channels in which it can transmit and receive the data if a mobile call is made and all the channels that are available to the cells are preoccupied then the call may go blocked that is a user may not be able to use the services hence in fixed channel assignment strategy the probability of blocking of a call is very high an alternative given for this fixed channel assignment strategy is the strategy of borrowing here one cell if it is using all the frequencies available and there is a need for one more frequencies to be used or a channel to be used then he may borrow a channel from the neighboring cell this borrowing is monitored by the msc msc is the mobile switching center which monitors the borrowing of the cell from the neighboring cell taking into account the future probabilities of blocking in that cell also it takes care of the channels should not be adjacent enough in such a way that there is an interference between them the second type of channel assignment strategy is dynamic channel assignment here the cells are not given a predefined set of channels here the cells are not given predefined set of channels instead the channel is provided on demand that is known as dynamic channel assignment strategy if there is a requirement of a call to be made then the channel is asked from a mobile switching center the msc then allocates a channel depending on the demand it also takes care that in a same cell no co channels are been given because of which the interference may occur it also needs to take care that the channels set up provided in a single cell are far apart the msc also has to take care that the channels provided in a single cell are far apart from the co channels keeping the minimum distance so that co channel interference need not occur for this to happen the computational load on the msc increases very much but the advantage here is because the channels are allocated on demand basis the probability of blocking of a call is reduced thank you so much for watching this video stay tuned to ekida and subscribe to ekida